Hello friends, very good evening. Myself Bala here. I welcome you all to my YouTube channel, Talent Traders. Those who are new to my YouTube channel, kindly subscribe the channel to get more update on intraday and positional trading strategies. So the last video we discussed about uh, that uh, uh, supply zone, right? So this video I'm going to try to make the scanner for a demand zone uh, where it is forms on the first five minutes that may be working for an intraday opportunity the finding a supply and demand zone uh, using the charting charting is the scanners and screeners will help you to find out the candlestick patterns and breakouts so a lot of things we can use from uh, that charting scanner so the last video we discussed about the supply supply zone now we are going to create a demand zone how it is working and i'm going to create that on a live video here right now so let me go to create using the charting let i'm opening the charting website here right now and uh, you can go for a create a scan so mostly i'm doing in a stock options so i i'll take uh, select a futures so you can select whatever the group you want either nifty 50 nifty 500 so here you can see a lot of options available even particular stock also you can focus for a watch list so here i am going to create you uh, that scanner for a futures and what i'm going to discuss here uh, it must be three green candle sorry first one is a green and the second one is a base and third one should be a another rally so that is called a rally based rally such a kind of things which i'm going to focus here and create here so the first one so you, if you are using the uh, equal candle that will be a uh, that that scanner will never repaint so because we are fixing the candle uh, that will never repaint so if you are using a previous candle maybe it may be re, uh, repaint so what i'm going to find out the first candle must be close must be greater than the open of the first five minutes candle the day of opening so this condition will find out the first five minutes candle would be a positive candle so if you go to check uh, yesterday <coughs> these are the stocks the first five minutes opened with the positive and the second conditions what we are going to do here already we created a scanner so you can just follow this method to find out the scanner so the second candle must be less than the open means that is what a negative candle so tata steel let me go for a check a tata steel about five minutes so first candle would be green and the second candle would be red so that is what the conditions we are filtering out on tata steel about five minutes so the first one is a green and the second one is a red so it is perfect and the third one what we are going to filter out simply copy the line and here we are going to make the third candle close is must be greater than the open so these are the candles so only few stocks let me go for uh, pause industries so for pause industries first yeah i think this yeah 915 should be green candle first one the second one is a red and again the third one is a green but we are not expecting all the candles which forms it must be a, a con continuation kind of pattern so let's look at this point it is a perfect zone where we are finding at this point there's a perfect zone where we focus for a demand right so let me go for this is the demand zone where it is exactly forms at in a five minute chart so this is what a zone where demand is creating at this point but still uh, after that breaking that high break and the high the market is keep on going higher and higher but this kind of pattern we are going to filter out that must be happen on the first 15 minutes that is what we are using three minutes uh, three five minutes candle so that must happen in the first 15 minutes candle so here our condition is right and uh, the second conditions what we are going to use uh, the second candle the second candle what we are going to do here we will do here the second candle candle low the second candle low must be greater than 
the first candle low right so first candle low the second one which we are going to focus was greater than and second one that high of the second candle the high of the second candle must be greater than the first candle high so it will fill down and the third candle we are using the third candle so the third candle close is greater than the first candle all right let me write the third candle close is greater than the second candle all right second candle high yeah, wait 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 the close is greater than the so third candle should be green the third candle close is greater than the second candle We filter out in this on any lever. Let me go for a chewer. This on any lever. Let me go for uh, checking about that. Yes, here that is what the exact thing which we are focusing it for a supply zone. Sorry, demand zone here. And let's look at the first candle is perfect green. And the second candle is red. The third candle is perfectly green so here we find out the zone for demand where that point is the demand zone but what happened here unfortunately it, it slowly uh, it was uh, the high of the candle is uh, 2722 and once it is broken and finally it triggers you the stop loss and immediately maybe the reversal so that is happening that dim and uh, uh, at this point where the low is broken so we can go for a sell opportunity with the highest level of the day it should be the stop loss from 2700 it coming down towards some uh, 25 points so let me check previous any other stocks we will save the scan finding and so save the scan to find out the back test and yesterday this was and day before yesterday we have one stock it's like escorts let me go for escorts what happened on that uh, it's looking day before yesterday right the date of escorts is around 22nd try to check it out 22nd right yes this is what the candle where it is forms zone for a demand that particular region so here uh, we can find out the uh, opportunity to break that level again after breaking the level if market reaches the same level there should be entry we can keep the stop loss and it was a big move after uh, the end of the day till this the big move which is happening on that stock and that was works well from 2200 to nearby 2150 so let me go to check some other stocks let me go for change that on a stage many stocks which forms at the date uh, this is what i see you can see the uh, result uh, it's uh, all about the same because it is never repaint so any time you can take it out on 20th of that tata motor mariko let me go to check whether it's all the right tata motors on 20th oh, yeah perfect now so big candle and the second one is red and third one so another perfect uh, demand candle so once it is broken there is a good opportunity it's quick move up to, to 436 to 442 so these are the scanners which i am creating uh, to make an intraday trade may may easier so that is the logic we are, we are creating the such a kind of scanners maybe it may be useful LNTFH LNTFH on 20th and 2 3 yes. 
same kind of pattern but it is not a black candle it looks like a doji but even after breaking that high of 82.5 it went up to 83 just 50 paisa and the low value stocks uh, it after that it is keep on going down no problem and uh, mariko let me go for a mariko same yes so such a kind of thing so mariko let's look at that mariko so perfect demand zone created at this opening and once it is broken from 520 it reaches somewhere around 500 and 530 plus 532 534 it reaches at the top and uh, closing is around 524 that is a perfect t so even you can find out such a kind of uh, thing on um, higher time frame too higher time frame is like uh, hourly and uh, 30 minutes 40 minutes even daily also we can focus such a kind of pattern if it is forms on a particular stock so it would be the best opportunity to take a supply and demand kind demand kind of trades so using that starting scanner very easily so the scanner may helping you to find out such a kind of pattern which is present right and uh, same like uh, demand all supply and demand both we can find out using the scanner and so such a great opportunity to find out that and if you want to check it out on a 15 minutes also we can go for a 15 minutes so just change the time frame at this uh, uh, 5 minutes area you just convert that 5 minute areas into 15 minutes so you can you need to change all the 5 minutes into 15 minutes then the scanner will work for a 15 minutes time frame so let me try uh, how, how the result will be there in the particular stocks but it never repaint that is important it never repaint the scanner so yesterday no stocks were filtered and let me go to the back test that is a one month and we got a very few number of stocks on uh, 22nd september we got a stocks like uh, pel iactc iex let me go for 15 minutes pel uh, this is happening on 15 minutes time frame on 22nd of uh, day so 22nd of pel 1 2 3 once that is a broken that level and it was uh, reaching some top the day itself from uh, somewhere around 969 uh, where you got a entry is around 1 o'clock only after your entry it reaches towards uh, 980 from 969 so that is what an uh, opportunity while using a uh, 15 minutes time free right and the second one uh, iacc tata consume even nifty also iacc So one, two, three. There is a no opportunity, and then it started falling down. ACC, Tata Communications, Tata Consume or Communication, Tata Consume, and where it is on twentieth. Here, let's look at the first green, red, and again a green. So it never broken that high, and then it started falling down. If without giving you the entry opportunity, the buy side, maybe that we we can take for a reversal opportunity at this low. and it has broken that a pattern as a from 800 it coming down to a 788 so other growth opportunity let me check nifty how it forms on the day the nifty we can go for here let's look at that nifty also looks same 1 2 3 so another uh, kind of pattern which is present here and it never give you the entry opportunity but instead of that we can go for a selling opportunity that was giving you some move and again it went higher and again started moving down so this may use for an intraday or you can change it for a positional also but this was working very good and well if you are finding any opportunities by using this method that will help you to find out such a kind of great trade opportunity i hope you may understand this concept and this is what the scanner you can um, you can make from your end so this is why uh, that's why i am showing you the how to make the scanner so here using the scanner so you can uh, you can make it all right thank you for watching this and keep supporting my channel and subscribe my channel and thanks for watching this video and thank you very much